Hi, this is Larry with Man Cave Mayhem. Behind me today is my 2021 Dodge Ram Rebel that I affectionately call Rex. Anyhow, uh, when I bought this truck, I didn't have a step. I was dumb enough not to negotiate in one of these really cool steps that come with these Rebel trucks. So I ordered the step and I wanted to go real quickly through this with you. Uh, it came in this box. The only other thing that came with it is a nut, a big old nut, which I hope is still here. Yeah, a nut with a bolt. So I'm gonna take you through the steps on installing this. So let's get started right now. All right, the tools needed for this project is a 13 16th socket. I recommend a cheater bar to break those nuts loose because they're big. And um, half inch drive ratchet. Um, they show a torque wrench here, but they don't really give tor torque specs. I just cranked the hell out of it with this and it worked really well. So that's all you need for this project. Let's get started. First thing we need to do is find this plug here underneath the car, uh, which is located here. And we're gonna pop that loose, get that out of the way. And we have to remove these two bolts here. So let's get started. The image in this picture of this plug is different than in mine. So we're gonna see if we can't just remove these screws without messing with this plug. I don't think we're gonna have to. Maybe we will. We'll look and see. Let's get under. Now with the setup, it looks like I just have to remove these two bolts and I might be able to slip this under here. Um, we're gonna give it a shot and see. If I can do that, then I don't have to unplug anything. So we're gonna remove these two bolts and then we're gonna try and put the step up in there. Let's see what happens. You can see this is what I'm what you're looking at on the picture. This plug here and the two bolts. These are the two bolts I pulled out. They're monsters. These things are big. And uh, I had to use a cheater bar to get it started. So that's something that you might want to consider. Um, now, I'll show you the difference here. See, this plug is right here. It's kind of in a different location. But here's the... The holes that we need to go up to so we're going to go ahead and put that up there now put the step up and uh, there's a little slot right here where the pin to the step goes you can see it right here and that pin corresponds with that slot if you can see the pin on the back side here and that pin goes in that slot that kind of helps hang it so that's what we're going to do next we'll go to that step and i'll be right back with you all right so i may have to unplug this but uh, I'm taking this uh, pry tool and I'm popping this little grommet off. It comes out fairly easy. And that'll get give me some room by those holes. So that gives me some room to get that up in there. See? So I think I can move this out of the way without causing any problems. So the 2021 is a little different than what they're showing in the picture. Maybe it's because it has different accessories. I don't know. But uh, we're going to go and try and get this up in there. I got this thing hung. It's like an origami situation. So it's it's a little challenging to get it up in there, but I was able to get it up in there without pulling any plugs out. Now I have to make sure the wiring doesn't interfere. So we're gonna look and make sure of that. But it looks to me like everything's good here. I don't think anything's gonna interfere with it. So now we gotta get this thing bolted in. It's hanging by that pin right there, as you can see. So we're gonna go now and start bolting this thing up. Now in my application, I don't need the nut. The nut is part of the frame on this. So this, this one bolt that comes with it goes in right here. It's not going in at the right angle cause I'm trying to hold the camera, but I can kind of show you how we're gonna put that in there. And that will get, Should get that in right now and that's threading right in Let's see how that works so on the 20 and you can see the other two bolts that are loose so i'm going to go ahead and get those tightened down now and then i'll demo the step for you and show you how it works all right so there's the step it's in push it down and you, it's really nice it's really well done. You're up in the bed before you know it. And then to push it back, you just pop it back. It's pretty, pretty strong step the way it is uh, designed. It's, it's really engineered well. That's it for the Ram 2021 rear bed step install. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe. Hit that bell for notifications. We have new videos coming out. 
quite frequently and I want you guys to be notified. And just remember, I'm just a man in a cave causing mayhem. Thanks again for watching.